Welcome to the Fives, beach hotel and residences, all-inclusive five-star resort north of Playa del Carmen, Mexico. Now the purpose of this video is to take you for a walk and give you as much information about the yummy food options by the pool and down by the beach. Let's go. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the Fives Beach Hotel and Residences. Five star all inclusive. Just north of Playa del Carmen, Mexico. We are at the end of the pier looking out into the Gulf of Mexico and just across there is Cozumel, the island of Cozumel. Very popular cruise port just off the coast it is mexico some beautiful beaches over there we're going to turn around here we're going to walk out this famous pier associated with the fives the purpose of today's video as i said in the intro is we are going to check out the food options on the beach and pool area now why am i doing this video now what happens is a lot of people get up in the morning, maybe they go out for some breakfast and they'll come down to the beach or the big pool area here and they'll set up shop. They'll get a Bali bed or they'll get some loungers. Maybe you've got the kids, you've got friends and you're kind of settled in here. Instead of packing up at 12, one or two and you want to go get some food somewhere else at a restaurant, uh, you might just want to stay here and head her on over to one of these four or five or six restaurants where there's food. Instead of packing the whole family up and going back to your room, maybe changing clothes and then going into a restaurant. So the purpose of this video is to show you the options for food today. Now I have come out the pier. You can see the Bali beds there. You can see volleyball court now a lot of people are probably just getting ready to eat now this is probably around one o'clock now I think the food opens around 12 and I think it goes till about 4 so this is kind of an afternoon place to get food now a lot of the lawn chairs here and the volley beds are full at this time a lot of people in the water so you're spending the day at the beach everybody's down here and like I said, instead of getting the kids and packing everything up, going back to your room, changing and going to a restaurant, you're going to stay down here and I'm going to walk you through the options. Now I just want to preface this video by saying that the beach, as all beaches in Mexico are, are public beaches. Now we've just gone by some ropes. Now these ropes denote a private beach. So uh, that pier is private and there was a guard standing there and he allowed me to go out there and then back so that is only for the fives but the beach in general as beaches in Mexico are all public you're allowed to walk on them but uh, we will see these ropes that kind of rope off the private section of the beach here now we are going to head over here to one of the first restaurant options I can't say it very well in my Spanish but the translation is pier 8 now we're gonna go over it's not open today so uh, the, on the odd day some of these um, so there it is Mul Ocho so that basically is translated to pier 8 and this place mostly has seafood options I've eaten there, it is good. Now it's not open today and I think what they do is they kind of scroll through the week every day one of the places will not be open. So this place is not open today but you can see the seating there, you can see the, the stools, you can see some people are still eating at the tables there and it's primarily seafood and other options but good options. Now I'm just gonna walk over this way here 
there's a little kind of drinks area here. Now, if you want to come over, you can see some people coming on over and if you've got a kind of a certain drink you want or a fruity drink or a certain mix you want, and you can see people waiting in line here. So that's what happened. This is one of the three or four bars that down at the beach. You're gonna see this bar, you're gonna see the main bar at the beach, and I'm gonna show you one other one near the end of this video. Beach is beautiful today. It's about 80 degrees, a little a bit of a breeze. The water is beautiful. And as I said, you can see Cozumel off in the distance there and the odd big cruise ship going through this kind of uh, in between Cozumel and the mainland of the Yucanan Peninsula here. So we are going to head up kind of and show you the kind of the real first eatery that is open today. Now this is one of my favorites and I'm just gonna show you, there it is right there, and I'm just gonna kind of freeze frame the options here. Now there they are, there's some uh, burgers, there are some empanadas, hot dogs, uh, and a gr grilled cheese sandwiches. This guy is good, he is fast. I'm Loved the burger. I had one a couple days ago. The hot dogs are good. Grilled cheese if you want a little something like that for the afternoon. And just to hold you over till dinner. That's kind of your quick, not a very long line there. And that guy is quick and he is good. And like I said, the burgers surprised me. They were really good. Now we're gonna go up this little ramp here. We're gonna come into the pool area. Now these restaurants that I'm showing you, if you're on the beach or at the pool area, you're eligible for these. You can kind of walk up and they're all super close within one or two minutes of walking. So if you've got a bunch of people, one person says, listen, I want pizza. Somebody says, no, I want a burger. You can go about your way. You don't have to go too far. You're going one minute this way. Somebody's going one minute that way. You have access to the food. Now we're going to head over here to the paella. Now this is kind of a rare, this paella is not here all the time, but they've always got something really innovative in this pool area. Whether it be sushi or something, an option like that, but today's option is the paella. So we're just going to walk by here. I'm going to show you kind of a, this is the front view, but I'm going to show you a top view of these big, I don't know what you would call them, um, that they make the, the paella in and they're huge. And sometimes there's paella classes where they teach you how to make it and they take you through the whole process. But I, I believe it's more of a Spanish dish. We've been to Spain and we've seen it over there, but they make a good paella here also. It's a little bit different. And like I said, they have classes. And I think I put a video out last year of them having a class, making it and how long it takes. It's a very elaborate process. A lot of shrimp, a lot of seafood in there. It's just fun to watch and to, to learn if you're really into cuisine and food from around the world. So you can see those Bali beds there. You can see the shower if you're showering off. Uh, we're gonna head around over here. You can see a scuba diving shop there to the right if you're into that. And there's so many activities here. They've got this health and wellness thing going now. It's just unbelievable, the options. We did some yoga yesterday. We just played some tennis this morning. So now we're gonna come over to the pizza area. This place is always buzzing. What's it say there? It's love pizza. Like I said, the lineups aren't very long. They've got a whole bunch of options there. You basically construct your own pizza. I'm gonna go around, there's some picnic tables there if you wanna sit down. You don't wanna take it back to your uh, chair or bali bed. And I'm gonna come around to the left side here and we're just gonna watch these guys. So there is that pizza oven. Like this thing is legit. They probably take about a minute, two minutes. Once they pop them in there, they're, I think they're at something like 700 degrees or something like that but they've got a whole bunch of the possible condiments in front of them there. You just basically say, yeah, I want this on it, this on it, this on it. They make it right in front of you. That lady now is going in there and she's gonna pull out one, see if it's done, it is done. She pops right there. And there, he's got five or four or five on the go there right now. So the lines are not long. 
You come up, that one looks like a pepperoni and she's kind of dicing that one up there. Look at that chimney there too. This is legit fast pizza in and out. The lines are moving. We are going to head over to this area over here. Now this area coming over here, sometimes it's more of a meat option, but we're going to see the taco option. We're also going to see a bar over here. You, got, you have seating. So if you want to bring the kids over, you want to come over and sit here and you don't want to take it back to your chair or bed, that's fine. So here is the drinks area. So if you're getting a taco here to your left, you can also see that the drinks are here to the right. And there they are. They've got a lot of fruity drinks, especially if it's hot on the beach, something to cool you off. And what we're going to do is we're going to turn around. So here is the taco man. And I'm going to try to get a kind of an over, kind of a top thing there. So sometimes they have the pastor, they've got the chorizo, they've got many different. You can see he's got the taco on the grill there. A lot of times they make them right in front of you. The, uh, the actual tacos, the shell, and there are the options you can put in it. I'm going to swing around here. And we're going to head her on out back to the beach area. I lied. There's, there's a bar at the pool area. There's also one I showed you early on near the, the grilled cheese area. I just showed you one there and we're going to come out to this other bar here on the beach. It's straight ahead and I like this one because it's got two swings. So a lot of times in these bars in Mexico they have swings at the bars uh, at a, a lot of the resorts. So this is one of my favorites because you can sit down and this one is usually not that busy. You can have a little swing. You can sit up at the bar, order the drink, maybe learn a little bit of Spanish, meet people from all over the world. We were playing tennis this morning. We met some people from England, also met some people from Houston, Texas. So it's just, you got people from all over the world. And this one's kind of a cool bar. I, I really enjoy this one here, just sitting down here. So you can see the water beyond it. I'll just give you a little bit. I, you can see the swings there. I can't really show you the swings from the other side, but I'm gonna come around. You can see the swings to the left there. Really cool bartender. Great sense of humor, and like I said, picking up a little bit of more Spanish each day. Mexican, very friendly. They, the people here are just unbelievable. And now you're, I'm looking across at the pool. You can see the big bar there right in the middle. So you'll see a lot of waiters going in and out, like they might be coming to your bali bed or to your uh, lounger, and they might say, hey, what do, you, what do you want? So you can see the swings hanging down there. You're going to see this kind of in Mexico around a lot of the bars. You'll see the swings. We're going to head back out here to the beach. And so there is a guard. Now he's just making sure that nobody comes beyond. You can also see the ropes here. And as I said, all Mexican beaches are public. You can see the little rope there to the left. And he's just making sure that uh, everybody's legit. So nobody from outside is coming in here. So regarding safety and security. They're on the ball here and you're going to see, I'm going to walk up to the pier here. There's going to be a guy at the pier and he's going to want to see my wristband to make sure that I can go out there to make sure that I'm from this resort. You can also, the volleyball seems like it's picking up a little bit. Some people have had some lunch. There weren't a lot of long, long lines, so uh, don't uh, be worried about that. So we're going to see this guy right here. I already kind of know him, but uh, I'm just going to give him the heads up, show him my bracelet, and he's going to allow me to go out the pier here. I'm going to walk out, I'm going to go right to the end, and I'm going to end the video at the end of the pier there. If you have any questions, pop them in the comments section. We're here for a while longer. Just want to say that is one of seven pools at the all-inclusive here. There's uh, adult pools, there's one for kids, there's ones that are longer if you want to do some lane swims or shorter ones. And there's just four, five, six options for food for lunch. So uh, you can talk amongst yourselves and see what you want to eat and each can go their way and they walk a minute that way and they get what they want. So I'm going to say thanks for coming along on the walk. 
I'm going to say ciao for now from the fives in Playa del Carmen. Just going to enjoy this view out over the water. See you soon.